next thing we need to do now is let's see where's our reference it these um so this is spacing all right so these are text inputs should be easy enough go down here is it product details orientation vertical yeah right here create a box layout for our text inputs say give it an id call it product inputs and let's take care of the size thing size hint size hint y yeah whoa size hint y non height the height is going to be uh 45 then text input mm -mm -mm. text input doesn't need a size hint nope but it does need an id id is going to be quantity input now the text input id is going to be is it the product code code input text input again id is going to be what's the next thing discount discount yeah id is going to be discount input yeah. another text input id is discount percentage input text input again Text input ID is uh, VAT, right? VAT input. Last text input again ID price, I believe. So price input text input one last text input id is total total input like that sizing now let's try the same size as we used so size hint x uh we say 0.1 now what i am going to copy this Paste it, oh, paste it, point three, paste it, paste it, paste it, and paste, paste, and point three, mm -mm -mm, point two, so that things balance out. Try this, uh huh. Now the height is a problem, so let's fix that. Mm -mm -mm. Your height is too big. Thirty. Fix that. Try that, and let's see if text is visible. All right, that's that. Perfect. So yeah, we are going to stop right here. All right. So look forward for the next one. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscriptions. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe already. Any comments, questions, leave them down below. I will try to answer as many as I can. Otherwise, as always, thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Welcome back. Today we will build. Let's see. Yeah, we'll start creating this box right here all right and at the spaces so
back to our code down here. Let's create a box layout as always. Oh, do we need to create a box layout? Let's see. Uh, product details, yeah. Let's create a box layout right there. All right. ID of this one is um, add to cut and uh, orientation. Do we need orientation? Yep, we do, but we need this box layout to be out right here. All right, so orientation for this one is vertical. And then in here, create a box layout. This box layout is going to be this one right here. All right. So, uh, where is that code right there? All right. Doesn't need. Mm, we just need labels here, so canvas that before. Let's turn it to a tail. Color. Color. Uh, RGBA. And point oh six. Point four five. Point four five and one. Rectangle size self dot size position self dot position done that mm, just a label will do for this text is uh, Code prog name and quantity. So code label again. Uh, text product name. Obviously, I am going to copy this. Paste, paste, product code, quantity, discount price and total. The discount price and mm, product total. Done that. Now let's size this. Mm. Hmm. What's on there? Operate right there. Size hint Y. And this should be pretty small. So. Mm -mm -mm height and about about that it should do take care of you guys so size hint x the first one point mm, uh this one's pretty big so point three product name uh if i were to say point three again Let's see. Point three. That makes it six. Do we have enough? Size hint x. Point one. Size hint x. Point one. Point one. Point one. Mm, try this. 
too small. Hmm. Ah, all right. We need to fix something here. What we need to do is probably just tap this in. So tap that in. Save and run that. Great. Uh, okay, so that, that looks okay. The next thing we are going to add now is the box layout, of course. So, box layouts right here. All right, give it an ID of all well, products. Run that and sizing. Yeah, that should work for now. Next one, we're going to take care. Mm, you know what? We probably have time, so let's take care of the uh, spacing. So, first thing is first. Obviously, one spacing right here. About five pixels should do. Next things next is this is the top one, right? So we need to have padding padding right there about 10 should do and then spacing right here about 10 should do as well so run this great now everything is starting to look good next one we're going to fix this and start editing the table all right so thanks for watching i will see you in the next one